cash receipts are easy to enter in Dynamics GP. Let's go to the sales area page, go to cash receipts, and start entering our cash receipt. The system will give you a transaction number. I'm going to tab over to the batch ID and put a batch ID in there and call it whatever I want to. This is the new one, so I'm going to add this batch. It defaults in with a checkbook ID. I could save, keep that or put another one in there. I'm going to save this batch ID. And now all the transactions that I enter here are going to enter to this batch ID. So let's take a look at the customer. Let's look up a customer for whom I've received a payment. Here's a customer there. I'm going to tab down here. This is going to be a check that I received. And I received that check for $2,000. So I'll enter that here. I can enter the check number if I wish to. I'll enter that here. And now this is the basic payment information. I want to apply this payment to outstanding invoices. Hit apply. I can hit auto apply and it will apply it to the earliest ones. Or I can pick and choose what I want to do. So I'm going to scroll down here. I've got some that need to be paid. Um, here's an invoice here. And I'm going to pay just part of this invoice. I'm going to pay $1,000 on this invoice. And then I'm going to select this invoice up here and pay the remaining amount on that particular invoice. So now I'm done with my cash application. I'm going to hit OK. And then I'm going to save that to the batch. And here's the batch here. So I can open up that batch if I want to. And I've got one record in there for $2,000. It's the one we just entered. I'm going to post that batch. And I'm done.